Soy John Eiberg, a.k.a. Juanito Eiberg, a.k.a. Biker John. And this is my world upon wheels. Bicycling again here in Brunei. Absolutely love it. I specifically planned for this. That was the reason I chose the AE Backpackers Hostel. Not for all the steps, of course, but because they had a bicycle. It is a, a single speed. That's okay. And right now I'm going to go investigate the hostel I've booked for a third night. Which does not have, oh, I'll find out if it has steps or not. Okay. Okay. Uh, it looks like I'll be taking a right on this road up here. I, I see. It looks like a quad bike. Oh, it, it's a Ciclovia. I think. Those people have geared bicycles. This is nice. Very much so. Sunday morning, it is a Ciclovia. I love it. I'll just go in here and take a look around here. I may even find out about renting another bicycle. Something with gears possibly. Those are not great drains. I just avoid them. I have to get over to that other side. Okay, there's, there's my entrance right there. Okay, I think it is anyway, it should be. All right. Good, exactly what I want. Sunday morning cycling. This is great. Four people bicycling, I love it. Sunday morning ciclovia. Brunei, Island of Borneo. This is great. Okay. This is what uh, then city council representative Beto O'Rourke had put through in El Paso, the Ciclo V in El Paso, maybe a decade ago. He is now a congressman. Beto O'Rourke, bicycling Beto, that's who he is. And, and now he is running for senator from Texas. 
Bicycling Beto, Ciclovia in El Paso, Texas, USA. And hopefully we'll get him elected to Senate, to the Senate and part of the blue wave, we hope. It's possible. Okay, now why are these people going to, these people are, thank you, good security. So this is what, Bicycling Beto O'Rourke, current congressman, future senator from Texas, USA, and get him in the office and we will have a lot more ciclovias and cycling in general, not only in El Paso, not only in the hidden gem of the world, the crossroads of North America, anchored by El Paso, Ciudad Juarez, and Las Cruces, but we'll have the complete good, great recognition of the International Fort Hancock Las Cruces I-10 Bicycle Bypass. There should be no bicycles on the shoulder of I-10 between Exit 72, Texas, Exit 72, which is Fort Hancock, Spur 148, and Exit 137, New Mexico, which is West Las Cruces. Because we have the I-10, the International Fort Hancock Las Cruces I-10, uh, Las Cruces I-10 bicycle bypass. Okay. Looks like this is where the sequel via could be ending. I'm not sure. Looks like it. I might have to, okay, good enough. This is where I'll stop here. Find out more. I'll turn around and pedal the other way.